an alien, I mean. Huh? <laughs> I even know where it's hiding right here on Earth. Really? The alien is up over this way. Once you see it, then you'll believe me. This is Neko Kuroha. <sighs> Gotta be her. Kurone of course I am. Have the two of us met before or something? <laughs> Maybe it isn't her after all. Are you freaking kidding me? Check out that body, dude. I mean, Jesus. I didn't even know they let girls like that go to this high school. I'm feeling kind of bad for what I'm thinking right now. Oh my god. Oh my god! Somebody help me! Well, that's fine. Today, two students at this high school are going to die. You! What are you doing here? But if no one joins next year, I guess the school will share anymore. No matter what you think, I'm not your childhood friend. You and I met for the first time today. Kashiwagi was supposed to die in the pool, but she ended up being sick. And then the other person who was supposed to die today. <laughs> 48 constellations. Interesting. That's a neat little trick. Are you making fun of me? It's just a multiplication table. What do you mean? Yeah, I know what they are. They're tables. I just don't like sitting at multiplication tables. You got a problem with that? Two times two. Huh? Huh? Well, uh... Two times two. Eight by two. By what? Eight times eight. Eighty-eight? Oh, muscle tone. Mm. Huh? What are you blushing uh, for? I, uh... It's just that nobody's ever touched my arm like that before. Makes me nervous, okay? Huh? She's pretty cute. In fact... It's like she's Kuroneko all grown up. Totally. <sighs> Go ahead, show me what you got. <sighs> You've got to be kidding. CQ, CQ. I'm here. Over. He's probably just going to end up dying tonight no matter what happens. <clears throat> Over. Actually, it won't matter much if you miss your bus anymore. Wait, what the heck was all that about? I won't be on the road and you might have a better chance of surviving. You got it? I've warned you. So don't do anything you'll regret. Two lives saved in one day. Uh, get out of here. You are the only one who can save us. Neko. Just managed to save a few people from dying along the way. I'll settle for that. Uh. CQ, CQ. Uh. He didn't. I told you to stay at the observatory. Do you want to die? The hell is she? But the moment you decided to ignore me and come out here anyway, then everything changed to compensate. Or what, I guess? They call me a witch. Huh? Don't be ridiculous. Really? You don't believe me? But it's okay to believe in aliens. How'd you get your powers anyway? <clears throat> Surgery. And drugs. Magic! The truth is... <sighs> It's not like I asked for someone to do this to me, you know? In fact, I ran away from the lab where they put all these- I never asked for any of this to happen. So I ran away and I'm never going back. It's like I said, I'm not your childhood friend, all right? Goodbye. I finally got to see the summer triangle! Uh-huh. I guess you're really looking forward to the beach. Not really. Hmm. So why the heck are you wearing a life preserver? <sighs> Shut up! Give me a break! I'm just in training! She died without ever... When trouble rears its ugly head You have nothing left to dread, to dread Cause the warrior cat is here, yeah! And cat is fast and fleet on her feet And everyone thinks the cat's uh, really neat Hey, Kuroha. <sighs> You were all dramatic last night, and now you're singing like a bird. Oh, shut up! And what are you doing out here anyway? Here. <laughs> the teacher was pretty insistent you went ahead and got this transfer form filled out and signed by tomorrow. I really don't need to. Huh? Give it a try and see what it's like, okay? <clears throat> Please stop it. You're irritating me. I can't let that happen either, okay? 
And with those mathematic skills of yours, it's not like you're going to be able to last very long out here anyway. Multiplication tables don't have any practical application in real life. It's coming from that house. Don't worry about it. Really? It sounds like someone's in trouble. It's not. Leave. I mean, if I went and made friends with him. But until that happens to us, we should do whatever we can while we can. Kana's alive, Murakami. Sorry. Kana can be pretty harsh at times. The guys at the lab? They got Kana <sighs> Oh, God. There's nothing we can do. Forget it. Kana. Uh, Neko, think about it. We don't even know where the lab is. We need to come up with a plan. <laughs> Kana! Kuroha. Get out of here. Don't bother. <laughs> You know what? You might be able to do something after all. What are you saying, Kana? We don't have a lot of time. You should go out and enjoy what's left, you know? Oh, come on. Let me be grateful to you in my own way, okay? Kuraha. Uh. Read. I can read. I was reading just fine. That reading you were doing wouldn't even get you to the fifth grade. Uh. I turned in the transfer form this morning. I bet you'll like it. We're going to the beach. You've got to go. I don't know. I told you about the girl I used to be friends with, right? She had always hoped to one day visit the beach. Look, you need to stop acting like I'm her, okay? It'll make it up to her if I do. Uh. It's supposed to be at the curry shop near the station. A woman in red will get hit by a car. I've got 15 minutes. 15? That's kind of close. Why are you following me? We didn't make it, Murakami. If we hadn't stopped for that lady on the bicycle, we might have been in time. I feel like you were responsible for killing them yourself. Now wait, what did you mean by lucky? Wait a sec, if no one got killed, doesn't that mean that Kana's precognition failed this time? Maybe. Wonder what happened. There's the lady on the bike we ran into. <laughs> Take a look. Check out who's wearing red. Huh? I think that ran into us, huh? It's not really that simple. <sighs> it's just gratifying to know no one died today. We don't have a lot of choices. Hey, what are you guys yelling about? <laughs> is that what I think it is? That smell. What smells so good? Huh? You smelled this? Uh, Yaki soba bread? And some cakes. Wait, what? You actually eat? Well, of course, genius. I gotta stay alive, duh. Kana can't chew her food, of course, but she still needs to eat. So, can we take a look at the cakes? These are so pretty. They're gorgeous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> look what you did, you jerk. Yeah, oh, I'm sorry. It's all yours. What? Are you sure? Do you hear that? He's gonna let us have the other one. We get to eat cake twice? What? Thanks for what you did today. Sure, don't worry about it. I'll be by with something else soon, okay? I want to say... Huh? What is it? It has nothing to do with you asking me. It's just that I'd really like to see the ocean, understand? Your nose is bleeding. <laughs> oh, 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 man. Girl. Okay. Did she get beat up or what something? What happened? Cold. I'm fine. I'm still gonna make the trip. <sighs> Clean her nosebleed. And how did you get like this? How can I help you? Murakami. The kitchen. In the back of the house. Please take me there. Of these every day. Or we'll die. 150 hours. That's all the time Kana and I have left to live here in the outside world. It's not like it's your fault, Murakami. I've wanted to see the ocean. It almost feels as if... Disgusting. I'm a mess. Bath water. It's more than we could ever use. What's wrong, Kuroha? I'm sorry, Kana. It's my fault. It's all my fault. Don't worry about it. I'll just die a little faster, that's all. I've seen how it ends. I saw what our friends went through when they get ejected. I won't suffer if you destroy me first. How do you... 
How do you know all that, Murakami? Having cherished memories that you want to hold on to forever, but forgetting them anyway. On. Is it possible for you to use your powers to get her where she needs to go or something? I can't. Sling? Then our only choice is to ask her to do it for a share of what we get from the factory. CQ, CQ, Kazumi. Sorry, but we're all out of pills this time. We're going to the factory where the pills are manufactured. If you help us, we can pay you with a share of the pills we get there. Wait a minute! That's kind of greedy, don't you think? Wait, who the hell are you? Neko, come! Are you sure I'm gonna die there? We already know that Sayori's gonna try and ambush us, but now... Having that knowledge might give us an advantage. Wait, if someone over there is waiting for us, they might have already moved the pills somewhere. Come on, Kazumi. What? Are you out of your freaking mind? I don't think- The bottom left is the port eject. If someone pushes it, then our bodies will disintegrate. The people at the lab would only tell us that it was worse than death itself. We should go ahead with this. There's too much at stake not to even try. Also, when Neko uses her powers, she loses things that are dear to her. Things that are dear? Hey, <sighs> don't the two of you have a bus and a train to catch? Get moving already! Yeah, right. Hang in there, Kana. You Neko. What are you doing? <gasps> hey, mind your business! Are you drawing something? And why would I be drawing pictures, Murakami? Through the front door? <laughs> you really aren't too smart, <sighs> are you? <laughs> you! <laughs> I'm not worried about dying, but I've got to keep her busy. I have to- Sailor! It's... it's Kuroneko's birthmark! No. Why, you forgot about me. Uh, no! I told you to stay a friend, Murakami! Please! <laughs> <laughs>